Now we're going to enter a part into tech metric. We're going to select on inventory from the left sidebar, and then we're going to select on new parts. Now here's where we can select a part, a tire, or a battery. We're going to select a part and hit continue. Enter the information for the manufacturer of the part, the part name, which is going to be an oil filter. Enter in a part number. And then any additional details we want to add to this part, we can put in here. We're going to select our primary vendor where we get this part from. We're going to add in the unit cost. And then we can put our own retail price in there, or we can use our parts matrix that we have set up in our system. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to enter in the quantity on hand. And if we want to enter in a location, we could do it here. If it's on a certain shelf, if it's in a certain bin, here's where we can put that information. And then we would hit save. Now we'll see the information that we entered in, what shelf it's on, how many are stock. And now let's enter in our min and max quantities. So we want to put a minimum. So when the stock level becomes at our minimum level, that's when we know to reorder and then the maximum amount we want to stock. We can edit at any time here. Look at all the information. And then this is how you enter a part into the inventory. Thanks for watching. Please do not forget to give this video a thumbs up and to share it with the rest of your team. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel if you would like to see more helpful videos for auto repair shops. Have a wonderful day.